It was Deng Xiaoping's first American-style news conference in China. So I think a, a, a situation which I can really summarize in the following kind of way, that uh, capital right now is too big to fail. We cannot imagine a situation where we would shut down the flow of capital, because if we shut down the flow of capital, 80% of the world's population would immediately starve, would be rendered immobile, uh, would not be able to, 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 to reproduce themselves in very effective ways. So we cannot afford uh, any kind of sustained attack upon capital accumulation. So the kind of fantasy that you might have had of socialists or communists and so on might have had uh, back in uh, 1850, which is that, well, okay, we can destroy this capitalist system and we can build something entirely different. That is an impossibility right now. We have to keep the circulation of capital in, in motion. We have to keep things moving because if we don't do that, uh, we are actually stuck uh, with a situation in which, like as I've said, almost all of us uh, would, would, would starve. And, uh, and this, is a, this means that, like, uh, that capital in general is, is too big to fail. It, it is too dominant and it is too necessary to us but we cannot allow it to fail. We have to actually uh, spend some time propping it up, trying to reorganize it, and, and, and maybe shift it around very slowly and over time 